Greetings to everyone from around the world who've joined for this International Summit of First Ladies and Gentlemen. And thank you to First Lady Zelenska for uniting us for this important cause to show that the world stands with you and the people of Ukraine. Since February 24th, when Russia launched another unjustified invasion of Ukraine, Ukrainians have suffered. Americans are devastated by the number of Ukrainians injured and killed. The images are heartbreaking. And yet, amidst extreme hardship, Ukrainians have inspired the world with your unwavering spirit and your determination to defend your country and fight for freedom. We believe that Ukraine will prevail in this awful war. And when it does, it will be the world's responsibility to help your country recover. We must ensure that the rights of all Ukrainians are protected. We must empower women to rise to key roles in post-war society. And we must protect the well-being of mothers and the education of children. We must help displaced Ukrainians return to their homes or build new ones. And we must address the physical and mental health needs of those who have suffered. We can and should help Ukraine return to its rightful place as a secure and democratic member of the Euro-Atlantic community. We know that a stable and prosperous Ukraine means a more stable and prosperous world. President Bush joins me in saying, Slava Ukraine, or glory to Ukraine. We ask that God bless the people of Ukraine during this struggle, and we pray for peace.